now I understand Benghazi documents have been subpoenaed by the State Department, by Congressman Issa, correct? There's a lot more there. There clearly was, people call it a turf war between CIA and State Department over the words. No, a turf war is when people are arguing over the dominion of a department, over, you know, over authority, over power, with no underlying issue. Here, the underlying issue, all the fights about the talking point were about who would take responsibility for the real scandal, which was the neglect, the dereliction in not having security right. for our Whose people. Fault and was that's that? what the argument was about. But I think there's a bigger story here, and here's the one that will in time come out. The biggest scandal of all, the biggest question of all is, what was the president doing in those eight hours? He had a routine meeting at five o'clock. He never after, during the eight hours, when our guys have their lives in danger, for he never calls Secretary of Defense, he never calls the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs, he never calls the CIA Director. Who does he call? About five hours in, he calls the Secretary of State. And after the phone call, she releases a statement essentially about the video and how we denounce any intolerance. Oh. It looks as if the only phone call was to construct a cover story at a time when the last the two Americans who died were still alive and fighting for their lives. There's the scandal, and that, I think, has got to be uncovered. Interesting.